What's going on guys? So I decided to wash my truck. I did wash it at the beginning of the week, but when I washed my mom's vehicle last night, I happened to get it wet. So it's just an excuse to use, finally use my new products from Shine Supply. So amazing. Pretty stoked on the new products. So I currently follow you up with what exactly products I got. I did get the trim shield. So what this is, this pretty much conditions and protects uh, the hard plastics that we have on the exterior of our vehicles. Uh, majority of the time, either they're nice uh, deflectors, uh, wheel, wheel dirt deflectors, sometimes some people have. For example, my mom's Honda has like a dirt, I don't know the proper term for it, but anyways. Uh, my truck has hard plastics either on the, the tailgates, uh, the upper trim of my bed, or even also my view mirrors, the, that outer, that shell has hard plastics. So my bumper has it as well too. So it really, I assumed not, you know, lack of knowledge. I just watched my vehicle and I assume everything else is gonna look great. But come to find out some materials, not this one specifically, but this hard plastic that it gets being on by UAV, UVA, UV rays, not UAV mono work. Oh my gosh. <laughs> I've been playing too much God. But no, uh, you, the UV rays literally beat on this material and then also being going off roading, mixing with dirt and other uh, bad, harsh materials, they literally damage this. So I did a pre test, or not a pre test, but I did start already. So this was uh, where my license plate was. So that's obviously, as you can tell, it's really dirty. And that is completely discolored, like got no life. I would assume by washing it, putting soap and scrubbing, it would bring it back to life. That's not the case. And so this is when I applied the uh, trim shield. Literally use my mic, use this little applicator pad. Very, just put maybe, I literally wrote a letter M and then just literally just rubbed it up against, literally not too diff, not too hard. Uh, just my common sense of just how to apply it. I'm sure there's other ways to apply it, but yes, that's what I did and that's what I got going on and it is looking so much better. Like it brought it back to life. So you can see it's really dry. And then I followed up a little bit more. It just like day and night, this thing's amazing. Just from afar, like it just makes my truck a little bit better. Especially knowing the fact that this is a Ford Raptor bumper. I still have my current bumper, the rear bumper, but I disliked it. I like the clearance on the look, the aesthetics for the Ford Raptor. And guess what else? By doing that, I'm able to add lights, add other more items. I, mean, I can even put like a little cyclone light in here or even on it and just have rear tail lights. It just, it's amazing. But yeah, that's what I got going on, working on today. Um, really just quick follow up, Trim Shield, just learning more about Shine Supply and all the amazing products that we currently offer. It's awesome, like literally I don't know, I don't do this very often, I don't, clearly I don't take care of my truck as often as I should or even really consider, uh, just for the longevity of, you know, our vehicles. You know, if you want to keep them looking good and so it can be less cost effective in the long run as well if it gets completely damaged or yeah just damaged um but yeah so yes link our link will be in bio and thank you for watching and hope you guys have a great day and keep yourself um safe and remain calm and despite the fact that we're all going through but hey it's everyday challenges and we're here for to do better. I am gonna clip that last comment.